Hello again, it's Dr. Como. I'd just like to clarify why Dr. is spelled wrong. I'm a big fan of The Simpsons, so it's a bit of a Simpsons reference. If you watch it, you know what I'm talking about. Um, although I am a legitimate doctor, I'm not like Dr. Riviera. Um, and yeah, I, I guess there will be points that I will do some more medical related um, scientific videos, but I'm just not in that zone at the moment. Like I mentioned, this is my complete sort of more creative, artistic, superficial, shallow, some, some, yeah, it's a bit shallow, I don't care. I'm just going to focus on the more enjoyable, simple things in life for now because it's been intense couple of years and so this is my chill but um, I will definitely speak more about things that I'm passionate about in future videos but that's not for the next few months at least. I wanted to show you what it was like using the laser, the Lima laser. I'm on day three now, it's my third day. I probably won't be posting this straight away so I've probably been using it for a week or so by the time I post it. Um, they had some products that were with the laser. I'm sure you saw them in the box. You've got this active mist and priming serum. So six pumps of this on the area you want to treat, which is my face. You're meant to leave it for a few minutes as the mist is absorbed into your skin. Um, whilst I'm doing this, I do, <laughs> what I'm about to say is completely contradictory to this entire video because it's all about trying to make your skin look youthful again. Um, I do hope that we can all start and aging a bit more gracefully. I'm seeing these movies on Netflix where they are creating clones of people so that their clones skin can be literally taken off and put on the face of another person whose clone that was. I, I can totally see that happening because that whole world's crazy and it's just getting crazier. That's got in and then I've sort of made a deal with myself that I won't dye my hair. I'm just going to go grey um, and do the whole salt and pepper thing which mm, might not be the best look but I don't want to commit to having to deal with roots there's so there's like more important things in life I don't know okay so you put the serum on and then you are meant to treat um doesn't hurt it doesn't it doesn't damage your eyes so you can go pretty close to your eyes it doesn't say you need to wear goggles or anything it's it's awesome so what i'm going to do um so i tend to do half my face um so i'll do this half for 15 and then i'll do that side for 15 and at the moment <laughs> i am watching game of thrones not games of thrones yeah i know i'm 10 years too late I was in my defense I was sitting exam um I had two babies back to back and I was you know doing that so missed it but oh I feel slightly nauseous all the way through it's brutal and it's got some really gross parts like the whole incest thing I just can't I don't know I know they look like humans but those guys aren't humans because they're really messed up crazy um, it's really complicated as well. I think I'm going to have to watch it a couple of times. Anyway, so that's what I basically do for 15 minutes that side. And then I do try and focus on these areas here um, and just under here and then sort of up here because I have got my... There they are. I have got my sort of forehead lines. Whatever. Just think it will make people take me a bit more seriously when I 
try and go with some doctor advice, don't they? Because the age is associated with wisdom, which is not always true, but whatever. So that's what that's what you do. That's it. You do that every day for three months. Um, I do. I know this is weird, but I do plan to do my elbows. I don't know why, but they 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 went again with pregnancy. My elbows and my knees just went a bit darker. It doesn't particularly bother me. Like I can't even see my elbow, but I just thought I'll give it a try. Again, my knees, I don't look at them. So <laughs> I'm not that bothered, but I'll give it a go and see if it works. So I have seen some before and after pictures of knees and they are looking like you've got like this um, wrinkly, saggy knee and it's just like, whoa, it's like a proper knee replacement, but not the joint, it's just the overlying skin. Um, also, looking through the very fancy book it's very fancy they spent a lot of money on the advertising um it doesn't claim to help with dark circles but it i did see in another review video that it that she felt like it did so don't don't quote me on that i don't want to sort of give you the wrong information anyway that's what you do I will catch you guys later.